Syria's state news agency Sana reported that 107 civilians were admitted to two hospitals in the city of Aleppo overnight on Saturday as rebels on the western outskirts of the city shelled the districts of Al Khalidiya, Shari Al Nil, and Jamiyat Al Zahra. Medical sources in Aleppo tell CGTN that though no one has been killed in the attacks, several cases were admitted into intensive care units. A senior officer in the Syrian Army Command spoke with CGTN, saying that the attacks were carried out using artillery shells loaded with gas. The officer said the gas was chlorine. The recent escalation highlights the difficulties of maintaining a Russian-Turkish deal for a truce in Idlib province. Idlib is the last rebel stronghold across the country and is the province adjacent to Aleppo. The province was spared a massive government offensive earlier this year when Turkey intervened. At the time, Ankara vowed to separate radical rebels from other factions and create a demilitarized zone separating government forces from rebel fighters. And while the Russian Ministry of Defense said its fighter jets annihilated all the militants who carried out the gas attacks, Damascus maintains official silence on the matter. However, anonymous government sources accuse Al-Qaeda's Syrian affiliate of carrying out the attacks. The rebels and the government have blamed each other on several occasions uh, with attacks using chemical weapons over the course of the conflict. Now, in its eighth year. Al-Ibrahim, CGTN, Damascus.